Hello, today I'm going to show you how can you copy project in project for the web. Let's say that we have project already defined and it will be the same project which I used in my last video. And now, as you can see in this project, I have some custom fields which I explained in my previous video. Uh, and those fields are here. Critical deadline, task cost should be approved by project manager, which team is going to work on it, etc. etc. I showed you last time that if you create brand new project from the scratch, then you will not have those uh, those columns or those custom fields available. In, a, uh, in this brand new project. So let me show you here. You will see that I don't have any of those. So I don't need this project. And I will do one thing. First of all, I'm going, I can, uh, uh, I have two ways uh, in which I can copy the project. I can go here, more options, and I have, I can copy project. Or I can go to the project and here in the project, I can click on these three dots, which is more options, and I can copy project. If I use this one or the previous one, it, I will have the same result. So I will click here on copy project and immediately I will have the project with a name as it was my original project, but with extension copy. So I can rename it, and that is first thing uh, uh, which you should do. And I will say this is my, uh, let's say, second project. Of course, I can now change here my start date. Let's say that it will start at, at August 3rd, 30, at, and that's it. Okay, everything is here, and now I can adjust tasks as I need. So I can say I need one more task here. So I will say uh, uh, insert task above, and I will say task A, which will last two days, and I will say it, it will, let's say, depend on task one. and etc etc i can do whatever i want but if i need only blank project so blank project but i need the custom fields and i don't want to recreate them from the scratch i can do this first of all i'm going to delete the project i will go to my project now here I will say copy project. I will have my new project. I will rename it and I will say my new project. And what I'm going to do, I can of course uh, change start date and I will say, okay, start date is one, once again, let's say third, 30th, uh, uh, August the 3rd. And I will close it. And now I will select all those tasks here. Okay, here which I have. So from first to last task, I will right click and I will say delete tasks. I will delete all tasks, all subtasks, subtasks, and what can I do? I can here now start with the brand new project, but I will have all custom fields here. So I can now say task A, three days, okay, but I can have critical deadline, which can be, let's say, not first of September, but I will say let, let it can be 6th of September that it will cost 
500 US dollars that should be approved by project manager and that is going to be uh, uh, performed by Croatia team. So there are two things. You can copy your project and have all tasks copy and also if you copy uh, all tasks you can rename the project and you can then uh, uh, delete some tasks, modify some tasks, add some new tasks, whatever you want. But if you need th the brand new project with no tasks from project uh, 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 from which you make made a copy, but you need custom fields, then in that case, copy your project, select all tasks, delete all tasks, and you will have blank project with all custom fields. That, that is a trick, but a good one. It helps me a lot. Thank you very much and have a nice day.